Hey everybody, Jeff Orchard here. Well, we're now on to episode 24 of Flint the Time Detective. Let's dive on in and see when and where we wind up today. Now, back from prehistoric time, here's Flint! up or down and I'm so bored. We've been lost for about a month now. It's time to give in. Oh, oh. That's the interdimensional emergency switch, boss. If you push it, the time police will be able to locate and capture us. You sure you want that? I can't hold out any longer. Our supplies are gone and I miss my dark lord. <laughs> time flow and you have been charged with serious time crimes we need you to answer some questions hmm. now for the record tell us what your real name is answer the question if you must know my real name is Nanya as in Nanya business don't be so rude answer her you heard him answer well this is spectacular she's an open book isn't she dr. Goodman I'm interrogating her interrogating that sounds yummy <laughs> I'm sorry, I was just having a little conversation with myself. By the way, did I mention how much I like your hair? Dr. Oh, you are out of line. Uh -huh. Huh? That's a red alert. A missile is approaching! Take cover! <laughs> missile! Hello. <laughs> I won't disappoint you this time, my love. The only thing that could beat me is myself, and of course that won't happen. <laughs> no more eating donuts! What about milkshakes? <laughs> Alright, boys, crack this thing up and let's blow this popsicle stand! They're getting away! Who's number one? Petra! Why do we keep changing the voice out? You gotta get up pretty early to beat the time dogs. Hmm? Oh, it's Dr. Goodman! What are you doing here? I was about to ask you the same question. We brought him along accidentally on purpose? We could dump him in the time flow if you want to. Not a bad idea. Hold it right there, <laughs> kidnappers! It's Flint! Oh, that's how he gets around. Oh, that meddling cave boy is always on my back. Lose him! <laughs> Look and learn, Doc. One that sent Petra. Now we can lose those two gooders. I have a good feeling about this mission.
Do you know where or even when we are, boss? I know the Dark Lord sent us here to find another shifter, but where do we start looking? So we're supposed to find a time shifter named Raldo, right? He could be anywhere. This mansion is spatial. Wow. Something is very familiar about this place. Goodman's the name, and science is my game. And I'm not the enemy. Hmm? A time shifter. I can't believe my eyes. Time shifter? Oh, nothing, nothing. Hey, that little guy wouldn't happen to be named Raldo, would he? Yes, he is. He's also my best friend. This is the glorious. Ah! Won't anybody come to help me? Not bad, huh? Oh. Oh. <laughs> Ever since that day, Raldo and I have been inseparable. But I have to keep it a secret because Mother wouldn't like him. Beefy, a turtle is not becoming of a princess. I just can't tell her about Raldo. I should do something. I think you might be underestimating your mother, Beefy. Parents are happy when their children have friends, but you shouldn't keep secrets from your mom or dad. Oh. Huh? He's mine now. Let go of me, Princess <laughs> You put him down. I may be a scientist, but don't think I won't wrestle you. Give him back to me. He's my friend. You better give him back to me right now. Mine? You hear me? Yeah, settle down, little girl. He's our merchandise now. If you don't let go of me, I'll have my guards come after you. And then That's we'll be funny. Married. When she gets all excited, she looks familiar like I've seen her before. You should put your goggles on. You think everybody looks familiar. She's a little brat, if you ask me. <laughs> <laughs> I wonder... And? <gasps> the petticoats! This can't be happening! I know why that little brat is here! It's because that little brat is me! <laughs> what are you talking about? I don't understand. Can this be? Is this the mansion where I grew up? <laughs> this isn't going well. Use your beam! <laughs> <laughs> hey, you trapped her! <laughs> oh, let's scram! Before he shrinks us! Get away, we scram! How do you feel? Not bad. Let me out of here this minute! Don't listen to her! Keep us in here, princess! Why don't you mind your own business? That little you won't listen to the big you. You won't listen to your children you. It'll take a lot more than Flint to intimidate Petrofina. What do you think you're doing, Petrofina Dagmar? Wow! Uh oh! Oh no! It's my mother! What? It would appear that she's holding a reptile in a shell, Your Majesty. A turtle is not becoming of a princess, Fifi. Now throw it away. We have a prince who wishes to make your acquaintance. This is worse than being arrested. This is my youth! You were a princess? I don't believe it. Believe it, science boy. Not only was I a princess, I was to become a queen. But I wasn't fond of arranged marriages, so I up and left it all. I gave up the whole shebang. Now get yourself cleaned up. More to get rid of that atrocity. It would be my distinct pleasure, your travesty. I mean, your majesty. <laughs> <laughs> Let's put the little rounder back where it belongs. Oh, 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 that's a thing. Is it rounder is a tortoise, not a turtle? No, come back so here. the Dr. water Goodman. is not a good thing. Where are you, Dr. Goodman? Do something, Merlock. We can't just wait around here. Flint and Dr. Goodman need our help. It's just a lot harder to get motivated without Sarah here. Dude. Who are you looking for? It's Raldo. He's trapped down there. Help! Look in here! Dr. Goodman! That time shift.
ship is trapped. It's a turtle. How can a turtle be trapped in the water? This kind of mission is so petty, it's beneath me. I'm a preeminent time detective, not a lifeguard. <gasps> Although there is an attractive damsel in distress. What more could you ask for? <sighs> it's a difficult job, but somebody's got to do it. Huh? Oh, no! No cats! Hang on, Dr. Goodman, I'll be right there! <laughs> turtle soup, anybody? Again, it's a tortoise. I know you're shell shocked, but we'll get you out. Petra stamped! Evil! What's happening? <laughs> well, this should be entertaining. Evil! What have they done to him? Don't worry, I'll save you! Hurry, Flint! Let me out! Rondo, now you're under my power! Isn't there something we can do? Out! Again. I'll get you, Petra! It's time to shell out a few nasty lists to that K-Board! Best you win! Rondo Corn! <laughs> <laughs> he looks mean! That's not Rondo! Take this! Ah. Oh boy! Her Majesty wishes you to come in immediately. It's not safe. Just grab her. Ah! Here's a few for you! <laughs> Release Dr. Goodman! What's going on, son? It's Doc! He's been captured by Petra Vina! Well, what are we waiting for? Let's rock some socks! <laughs> Trafina, 
you should be listening to now attack! Endangering yourself. You're much too close. I oh. can't abandon my friend! Rondo, stop! <laughs> what happened to my sweet friend? You are good inside. You must believe me. Please believe me. This is so horrible. This is not working out. Now stop this! I didn't want to get forceful, but you made me, so behave yourself! Stop your whimpering, Rogo, and get rid of that girl! You mind your own business! Did you? That was pretty disrespectful! Yeah, she's got Vim and Verb! Now think back when we first met. Remember, Rogo, when you tried to save me? Try hard to remember. We were best of friends. Petrofina as a girl. It's too bad she didn't stay like she is now. You are the best friend a princess could ever have. I'll never forget you. In the future, think about me. Uh, as for you, you better make sure Roldo's all right or you'll have to deal with me. I'll take good care of him, I promise you. <laughs> You've got nothing to worry about, princess. He's among friends. <laughs> so long, Petrofina Dagmar! Erase mode in effect. Damn! Soon <laughs> we can't just, I don't know, just leave her as Bye. she is right now with the I'll memories. Miss you. Bye. Oh, that might then affect future Petra. Huh? Why am I standing here? That princess is filled with such passion. Her ability to love is admirable. I can be admirable too. Just watch this. If she misses Waldo, that means Sarah will be missing me one day. That would make me the happiest vampire alive! <laughs> Big deal! Whoops. You're saying you reject this marriage? Yes. I will marry for love, not convenience. I want you to be sure about this. Is that your final answer? Final answer. Very well, then. It's too bad, though. He's a striking man. Mortimer, compose a rejection letter for Prince Sowich. Your Majesty, there are more marriage proposals. Evidently, your daughter's quite popular. Of course she's popular. Doesn't surprise me at all. This is Prince Apostolina from Greece. Hmm, very handsome. Too short, though. This is Prince Garcia from Barcelona. Oh, beautiful. They can match make all they want, but I still won't accept it. <laughs> are you telling me that young Petrofino was a princess? Mm-hmm. That's as believable as me being a detective. Don't kid! That's not funny, Flint! Do you think there could possibly be a mix-up? Some people just change. Absolutely right. It's my understanding that Attila the Hun was a perfect child. It's so weird, from a princess to a time criminal. You think Petrofino was actually evil from the very beginning? <clears throat> no, she wasn't. We're just speculating. We didn't mean to upset you. If you say that she was good, we believe you, Raldo. I just wonder what happened that she became a time criminal. I may be a genius, but women are still a mystery to me. Huh? He must be talking about Jillian. All his thinking's making me hungry. A mystery. Oh, yeah. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> well, that was a 
an interesting episode. <laughs> Now we know Petrofina's actual full name, Petrofina Dagmar. Hmm. I wonder if we're gonna see her mother making a reappearance. <laughs> oh boy. You know, I will laugh my ass off though if the Dark Lord turns out to be one of the rejection letters she put forward. That'll be funny as hell! <laughs> oh well. <sighs> Raldo Master later on in the future is going to be an interesting fight against Petra, methinks. Ah, <laughs> oh, well. Jeff Arsfiend, out.